Hey. Yo guys, Cam from Power and Precision and welcome to my football boot collection video. Today we've got some limited edition boots, some current releases and also some bold and colourful designs. So make sure you smash the like button, let's try and hit 500 likes for this awesome collection and yeah, let's get straight into the video. So the first boot in the collection is the Adidas A17 Plus Pure Control. It's in a lovely black and pink colourway and we tested it at the Master Control event in Bristol. Next up, we've got the Puma Evo Power Vigor one in this launch green colorway. It was a great boot to test. It looks really cool on the pitch. Enough said about that boot. Moving back to Adidas, we have got the X 16.1 in this winter camo colorway. They're definitely one of my personal favorites. I can't complain. The first limited release in the collection is the Nike Watner Mercurial Superfly 4. These boots were made to commemorate the 18 year legacy of the Mercurial by slapping 16 of the best colorways onto one boot. Then we move on to an elite boot for elite players. Of course, this is the Nike Magista 2 from the Elite Pack. The boot's really comfortable. It looks great on the pitch. I love them overall. Then we rewind to the 2014 World Cup when Nike released the Superfly 4 in this Hyper Punch colorway. These were my favorite boots at the time for about six months and I still love them now. Rewinding even further in time, I have got the Nike Mercurial Vapor 4 in the SL version. The orange peel colorway was worn by Cristiano Ronaldo when he scored that mad free kick against Portsmouth. Jumping forward in time, we are back with the Adidas A17 Plus, this time from the Blue Blast Pack. The boost technology makes these boots on a new level and I love them. Perhaps not the most popular boot, but these are the Nike Mercurial Superfly 2. They're very stiff, I haven't worn them much, but nevertheless, I do like them. Next up, we've got a more traditional colorway in the Hyper Venom 3. I received these at the Nike Strike Night with a Bamiyang, and to be honest, I think they're the best colorway to date. But then we go back to the launch of the Hyper Venom, and we've got this half and half design with the green and orange. I was a big fan of it, and more importantly, I love the comfort and performance of this boot. Next up, we've got the Adidas 15 Plus in the Prime Knit variation. I wish I wore them more because the comfort was that damn good. Next up, we've got my favorite colorway of the Adidas X 16 Plus Pure Chaos. They were released ahead of the Euros in 2016, and I love the chrome sole plate on them. They are brilliant. Next up, we have got the CR7 324K Gold, which were made to commemorate Ronaldo breaking the club record at Real Madrid by scoring 324 goals. I love them because they're a recreation of the Vapor 3 and also the CR7 Glitter Heel Tab looks great. Next up, we've got a more underrated boot in the New Balance of the Zara 1. I really like the colorway of these and although they were stiff to break in at first, I do enjoy playing in them when I wear them. Next up, we have got the brother of the Vizarro. It is the Furon 2, and this boot again is quite stiff to break in, but the thin material gives you a good touch on the ball, and I love shooting in them. Moving on to the more business end of my collection, we have got the CL7 Forged for Greatness Superfly 5, which was inspired by his time at Manchester United. I love the look of these boots. I love wearing them. They were super comfortable. Hands down, no complaints. Another addition to my collection is the brand, brand, brand new Adidas X 16 Plus Pure Chaos in the Champagne Pack. I'm a big fan of these boots because they were inspired by the Predator Mania in 2002 when David Beckham scored that free kick against Greece. So the second to last pair in my collection is the Magista 2 in this bright and bold, colourful design. I got these when I trained with Kevin De Bruyne at Manchester City's training ground and I haven't worn them since. And the final boot in my collection is the CR7 Vitorious Superfly 5. They were limited to only 777 pairs worldwide. I was lucky enough to get them in my UK size 9. And the reason I love these is because of this beautiful white upper and the gold chrome sole plate. You can't get much better than that. So guys, that concludes this football boot collection video and I really hope you enjoyed it. I would like you to drop me some comments down below with what your favorite boot was. I'll try and reply to as many comments as I can, but thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time. Goodbye.